today, Christmas, Carnival, Teacher Cheryl, Animal Ambulance, International Week, Secondary Student at Primary. Welcome to UWC News. My name is Patrick. My name is Shimon. My name is Pavel. Our last broadcast was just before Christmas and all our classes students have been practicing a song for the Christmas celebration. In this report we will give you an impression of the assembly and the secondary canteen. This year we celebrate Carnival in our primary building. At the start of the week, a prin prince and princess were announced. Prince Hugo and Princess Louisa moved from Brazil. They got their special court thing from teacher Joey and teacher Nanya. The first went to see teacher Peter Howe and then went to all classes. In each class they looked very well to find out who had the most original carnival clothes. The student received a small prize from the prince and princess. In October, teacher Cheryl had to leave our school because she turned 65 then. In the Netherlands, teacher had to retire at that age. But she came back to pay us a visit. Mihalina had an interview with her. Good afternoon, teacher Cheryl. Okay, may we no. ask you some questions? You may, with pleasure. How are you, teacher Cheryl? We haven't seen you for a long time. Well, that was because after I stopped working, I went to the United States, to California, for a couple of months to help my mother, and almost got a job there teaching because I miss teaching so much. Did you like to work here? I loved working here. And you don't know how much I miss it. I miss all the people and all the children. I miss people. If it was possible, would you like to stay here? Yeah, I was would have liked to have stayed for a few more years. But because of economic times, that wasn't possible. The, the system now doesn't let you work after your retirement age. Okay. Why did you choose our school to teach in? 
Uh, because my we moved here. Well, you miss the school when you were with us. Yes, I miss the school terribly. I, I miss, what I miss is the contact with the children. I found that every time I would see a, a child in the supermarket in the States, I always had to talk to them because I was missing the contact with the children. How were you feeling when you were leaving the school? Very, very upset. <laughs> very sad to leave. Will you visit uh, us sometime in our new school? I will. In fact, I've, I heard there's an international week next week on Saturday and I'm going yeah. to come to visit. Ooh. Hopefully, I'll put it on my agenda. Okay. Okay, thank you for the interview. Oh, you're you. welcome. Year 6 had a picture action to raise money for charity. They invited parents to come and see if they liked the picture so much that they would like to buy them. Many of the pictures were sold. Hello? Of the Queen? Can we have a picture of the Queen? Hello? Can we have a picture of the Queen? Can we have three or four euros? Going once. Year one I had a school trip to the Pilken. This is sports center in Maastricht. They, there they played some very exciting games. Year 5 had a field trip to Bishop's Mill downtown. They grind corn with the help of water mill and bake bread and fly. And that is exactly what students did. Make their own little fly. Right here, over the case. Maybe you heard latest news about teacher Catherine already. She is going to leave us and will go to an international school in Spain. More about that, this topic in our next broadcast. Less than four months, we will start moving from this building to the new campus and we will start, start the new school year. Preschool and kindergarten invited the animal ambulance to show us their special animals. Some of them were really special, like the snake. Teacher Karen showed it to all the children. Many children wanted to touch the snake or stroke it. They also brought some owls. These owls were so used to seeing children, they did not mind to be touched. The small one even like to play. The children like to play with the turtles and the rabbit. For International Week, every class worked very hard to learn about interesting things of a country they had chosen. At the end of the week, we had a tour around the world. The classes, they showed us what they had worked on. We saw many different things. There were dances, songs, and stories. Here, Mrs. Pe Peters tells preschool children about Africa. Rabbit. Tiger. Rabbit. Tiger. 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 Ti
Mia, yeah. can you tell me what you're doing? Support you these tiles. Is that a The international fair was held on this Saturday. Parents and children shared a lot of information about their cultures. Some of the countries had a very nice performance. Secondary students have four hour students about the music instrument that they can play. It was amazing to see how go how good they are. proud to see Nina playing the cello with one of the secondary students. The, the guitar is um, it's a six-string acoustic instrument. Uh, the, the strings are usually made of either nylon or steel.
Well, you done done me, you better felt it. I tried to be chill, but you so hard that I melted and fell right through the cracks. Now I'm trying to get back. Before the cool done run out, I'll be giving it my best. It's so nothing's gonna stop you but divine intervention. I reckon it's again my turn to win some or learn some, but I won't hesitate. No more, no more. It cannot wait. I'm yours. You win. Anytime. <laughs> this was all the news for this time. Thank you for watching. And we hope you will watch us again next time.